This was my favorite trolling of the day that started as trolling and turned into an enlightening moment. So uh, somebody named ShaneMT4 on our favorite Instagram says, uh, sends me a private message. I don't treat ICT concepts, but you are seriously a piece of shit for trying to derail some young adults trading community. If they found success trading whatever the fuck they learned on his YouTube, let them have that. You are so stupid if you really think that they are pushing people to sign up for brokers and prop firms. Ha! When both of those kids don't even trade live accounts. Wow. They trade demo and they claim that. Mmm. I get that you have a thing for Michael, but these kids are innocent and have found success in his work. Leave them alone. <laughs> oh, this is going to be fun. Well, let's talk about the things we agree on first. You refer to them as kids, and yes, you're correct. Michael and these other scam artists prey upon them in their ignorance, and yes, I recognize that that prey was misspelled. That's voice to text. Don't blame me. Honestly, I wrote this out of rage. Okay, so now we're getting some truth. I said, well, one day you'll grow up. He says, it probably wasn't the best worded wall of text. I don't even know you. Do you really believe those kids are scammers? Okay, so now look, he's, he's starting to level, so I'm going to go ahead and have the conversation. I drop him a couple of screenshots. Oh, sniper entry from this group. Uh, deep underneath in the comments, it literally says, hey, go down and check out this broker down below. So I sent him a few of those. Um, let's see. I can believe that ICT is. Okay, so he's saying that another group that I basically wrecked the other day went to the Discord, and I see these three guys. The Giving Trader... Uh, trade artist something, and um, hold on. What was the other one? It'll come back to me. Anyway, I find all three of them grouped up in this room pushing FTMO, trader funding program garbage that literally like wrecks every person on the other side of their trade, but we'll just get onto that later. Let's keep on. This is fun. I have screenshot after screenshot of these idiots pushing brokers and trader funding BS. He says, the same two kids you named... These are different pages, no? Okay, first of all, it wasn't just two kids. There are three in that room. Again, I can't remember the other name of the other guy. It'll come back to me in a moment. But there are three in this little Discord that have grouped up together to start selling kids on FTMOs and pushing them to crap brokers so that they can be the introductory broker. Mind you, they are not announcing that they are the introductory broker or the risks associated, which they are supposed to have, which means it is illegal. I have pointed this out. However, let's continue on. I said, you don't know who I am, and it's fine. One day you'll figure it out. I am the number one algorithmic trading platform founder in the world. I said, I have hundreds. Stop focusing on the trees. There's a forest, because he was talking about the two above. I have hundreds of screenshots showing these people pushing these FTMOs and brokers. I said, I'm not going to speak to you if you're going to be speaking so ignorantly. He says, okay, okay, I'm sorry. Okay, so now I can tell this person's actually maybe just you know looking for some legit info. So let's drop the bomb, shall we? I said, I do not spend my time with low intelligent individuals who are high. Uh, oh, are you high intelligence or are you going to keep talking low intelligence? I do not mind having an intelligent conversation. If you want to know information, I can give it to you. No single troll on the internet is ever going to impact or change what I'm doing. I know the truth and the truth only sets people free. I am the wrecking ball. And when I bring the wrecking ball, there is nothing that can stop it. I have the number one largest futures trade room in the world for a reason. You don't know that yet, but if you take five seconds, you could find it. As far as what you're mad about, I honestly don't care. But if you want to remain poor, I also don't care. But if you're part of the individuals who prey upon the weak, the vulnerable, the young, I promise you, I will bring your house of cards down on your head in the same way I bring the house of cards down on these bigger scammers. I eventually will get to you. Please wait your turn. Now... That was my test bed to see if this person is affiliated with someone, and they said, no, I'm not affiliated at all. I'm not even in their community. Hmm, okay, well, so I still don't understand why this guy's upset. So, so that's fine. Then what are you upset about? I don't give a crap about Michael, the ICT turd. I care about the people he's hurting. I care about the people he's targeting. I will simply remove the head and leave the truth to remain. He says, I've just spoke with the one young man, the giving trader, and, uh... He was always very kind and never tried to sell me anything. Oh, okay, so he's connected. The giving trader guy. Yeah, yeah, he wants to give you free stuff, so you'll go sign up for his FTMO. Yes, that's how his whole thing works. But yes, I believe ICT is a shill who pushes some bullshit 12-month program to feed his bank account. Okay, so he's got some his information. I said he is a liar and a thief, and I am providing a way for people to find the truth before they lay down their hard-earned, hard I was supposed to say hard-earned, money. 
Um, the giving trader, do you even know his real name? Because I do. Let's just see how much you really know about this young man. Now, again, he's talking about the giving trader. There's a guy called the giving trader. Uh, something Mexican with a J, LOL. I said, what is his real name? Javier, I don't know. I said, no, it does not start with a J. His name is Nick. His last name starts with a C. Again, another person hiding in the shadows, pretending to give people free information about trading, showing them fake withdrawals, getting them hooked on his free BS. They are going to sign up for FTMO, and he's going to get paid because they sign up for FTMO. They are going to waste that money. They are going to waste their time learning that horseshit, and they eventually will blow their own accounts. So he says, what do you recommend? someone uh do if they want to learn to trade so now we're finally you know look sometimes you got a little smack around and then the truth sets them free i will continue to expose all of them if you have a problem um, with it you need to ask yourself what's wrong with you um arguing with the messenger is a mistake the markets are controlled by algorithms he says yeah i've already accepted that you said and i'm not angry okay that's good if you're not using an algorithm to fight back you're losing of course, this is my opinion. I'm obviously biased, but I would tell you at least look into a room where there is truth. If you are mentally stuck on Forex, then I would go and study and learn from Tom Dante. He says, you can go along with the slaughter. I've voiced my opinion and I've heard what you said. I realize it was silly of me to even get involved. Okay, that's great. Said, if you want to be the best in the world and have the best in the world and use the algorithmic approach to the markets, then there is only one algo box. There's the link. This is the world's number one largest futures trade room in the world. But there is also an ex-ICT students and an ex-Forex students on the left-hand side. Feel free to have conversations with them. He said, how many thousands of dollars are required to actually learn there? I said, well, if you're really smart, you will just start writing to the training. I was supposed to say right into the training and stop BSing around. I said, it costs exactly $0.0. Now shut the F up and have a nice weekend. Bye. <laughs> okay, Okay, thanks, Vinny. See you around. You little half face. And, of course, the goat. And he says, I get it. Are you the goat? <laughs> hope you guys are having a fantastic weekend. And I hope you guys laughed about that conversation as much as I am right now. Have a great one. See ya!